Hi, this is Shady, and today we're gonna see Judo's most classical throw, Ippon Serenage, or Serenage with one hand, and see just how effective it can be, even at the highest level, not only in Judo and Jiu Jitsu, but also in MMA. So, uh, this technique uh, it is taught very early on in your Judo journey from white belt. Obviously, you're not gonna master it at white belt, but still. So, what we will do today is look at two examples. One that was done very correctly, while the other one just got lucky, but still ended up with the KO. So let's take a look at the first one. It's in Bellator. Here you see the fighter tries to clinch, and so he got a hold of his hand and finished it with Ippon Serenage and got gets the KO immediately. So Ippon Serenage, we should understand that it's a Teiwaza or a hand technique. It's not. Like a lot of people do, just load on the hips and then finishing off the movement by cutting with their hands. It's actually really pinning shoulder to shoulder and cut down as if you're cutting with a sword and that will get the throw and not so much landing, I'm sorry, loading on the hips and from there you cut down with the hands. But it's actually from top to bottom. You can actually do it on a much shorter guy and still uh, if you're doing it in Teiwaza style. So let's take a look at the second one, which is absolutely insane. Failed Serenage completely gets the KO. He cannot even load him on his back and shoulders. Just cuts down with the hands and just lands him on his face. Lucky KO and with a bad Serenage. Now you might say this was Uchi Makikomi since he went right underneath and just had his uh, lats on his shoulder and went down. I wouldn't say so. In my opinion, it is just a failed Serenage that got lucky because Uchi Makikomi, as you see here, it is actually a sacrificial technique, not a Teiwaza. So you actually have to throw yourself completely in order to finish the throw, as you are seeing it here. Um, Takeshi Sasaki is one of the few that actually does the throw. It's a very rare throw to be done even in Judo. I believe also um, Maria uh, Lairke Olsen of Denmark is very good at that and all sorts of Makikomi. So here you see... This is a very short video that I wanted to do about Judo's classical throw and how effective and devastating uh, it can be. So, uh, and no gi needed at the same time. So, uh, if you have anything else to add, please let me know down below. Also, consider supporting me on Patreon for exclusive content only. Your support would be greatly appreciated. This was Shadi, and as always, thank you for listening.